It's my uh, great honor. Now. I wanted to make a film about the importance of not being a bystander as history passes close to you, giving all of us a chance to do something before it passes us by. And so that film was Schindler's List. What an extraordinary honor to be with you as we honor four righteous individuals whose courage is measured in the lives they saved. One child, one refugee, one comrade at a time, and who, in so doing, helped save our world. We hear their stories, and we are forced to ask ourselves, under the same circumstances, how would we act? And too often, especially in times of change, especially in times of anxiety and uncertainty, we are too willing to give into a base desire to find someone else, someone different, to blame for our struggles. So here tonight, we must confront the reality that around the world, anti-Semitism is on the rise. We cannot deny it. And when we see some Jews leaving European cities where their families have lived for generations because they no longer feel safe, when Jewish centers are targeted from Mumbai to Overland Park, Kansas, when swastikas appear on college campuses, when we see all that and more, we must not be silent. Anti-Semitism is a distillation, an expression of an evil that runs through so much of human history. And if we do not answer that, we do not answer any other form of evil. Thousand inhabitants of the ghetto had been deported. To it means cultivating a habit of empathy and recognizing ourselves in one another to make common cause with the outsider, the minority, whether that minority is Christian or Jew, whether it is Hindu or Muslim or non believer, whether that minority is native born or immigrant whether they're Israeli or Palestinian. 